The vessel, which arrived from the seashells, is allowing visitors to explore its extensive range of books whilst uh, providing an exceptional opportunity for learning and discovery. CGTN's Dina Mtengo uh, tells us more. The world's largest book fair, the MV Logos Hope, is currently docked in Mombasa on Kenya's coast. Hundreds of reading enthusiasts have for the past seven weeks been treated to a wide range of literature in a collection which involves more than 5,000 books. I believe that there is a book for everybody that visits the ship. We partner up with uh, different companies and so what happens is they give us a, a discount on different kinds of books. Um, we also have the opportunity uh, of getting some books for very reduced price so we can also sell them for a better price. According to officials, the Extraordinary Vessel redefines the concept of a stationary library by embarking on a global adventure. More than 50 different nationalities make up the volunteer crew aboard the vessel. But being away from home for months or even years does pose its fair share of challenges. Yeah, personally, I miss my home. Yeah, that is one of the challenges. I miss my family. I'm looking forward to seeing them as well. Uh, but as I said, so many countries, so many different backgrounds. Sometimes you will imagine that it's hard, uh, but that's how we share also hope, trying to, to learn from each other, trying to maybe just think in another perspective, you know, so that makes you uh, grow so much. The historic coming of MV Logos Hope only adds to the list of academic-related vessels on a maiden visit to Kenya. I think it's a great and unique way to promote literacy. I give it a thumbs up uh, because it draws interest and people like to come to a place where they have never gone before, especially being on a ship. Just eight months ago, the cruise liner, the MV World Odyssey, a state-of-the-art floating university, also hit the country's shores. The MV Logos Hope has visited over 200 ports since it commenced its operations in 1970. From here, the MV Logos Hope will visit four different countries, including Tanzania, Mozambique, and South Africa, where it is expected to share knowledge, literacy, and hope in every port that it visits. Reporting for CGTN, I'm Dina Matengo in Mombasa, Kenya.